Hey guys, it's Drew here, and I'm starting the review process on an awesome hammock from Hennessy Hammocks. It's their ultralight backpacker asymmetric classic. Comes with this rainfly that has just enough space to cover you. This is the first time I've strung up this hammock, so bear with me as it may not be perfectly adjusted. You can string off the rainfly at multiple points to your desired shape. This will protect you from rains. The hammock comes with the mosquito net attached to the hammock. No worries of no seams or mosquitoes. The straps here are an interesting design compared to what I have become accustomed to growing up with the Eno and the Atlas straps, but they're very functional, they work nicely. There is a bottom entry. And here you can see I have their bubble pad for keeping you warm. We do have some cold nights that we get here in Ocala, Florida, so I may be putting this to use. I think it would definitely keep you warm. You also have a personal storage compartment. You can place your phone, snacks, whatever you need. The entry is Velcro, so it Velcros together nice and easy. I'm going to go ahead and exchange the fly for the hex fly, which is much larger. So here it is. I went ahead and spread you the process of me stringing it up. This covers a lot more space and provides you with a place to camp under and make your food. Again, with the multiple tie-off points, you can adjust it just the way you like. On the one side, I attempted to raise it a little to create a little more airflow. Although, right now, as I was stringing it up, it it wasn't necessary to have a fly at all, but I would like you guys to see the difference between the hex fly and the fly that it comes with. Now, you would have to decide whether this is necessary for you. If you are going for the ultra ultra light, then you would probably do best with the, the fly that comes with the ultra light hammock. I enjoy the amount of space this provides, and I'm very excited to have many camping experiences under this. I would like to go ahead and show you how I get into the hammock. This may change as, again, this was the first time I got in this hammock, and I am looking forward to many more experiences, camping, and stringing this up in some really cool places. I can't wait to show you guys. So relatively easy to get into and out of, but definitely something you have to become accustomed to if you are not used to the bottom entry into a hammock.
here I would like to demonstrate the leg positions that you may choose with the bottom entry, one leg on either side. This is very comfortable or laying asymmetrically and both legs on one side, which was okay, I preferred the other. Again, this is something very different than what I was used to having the bottom entry, but I like it a lot and it makes sense. One last thing, the extra large snake skins, which completely cover the hammock, make it extremely easy to pack and to unpack and also to set up. I hope that you guys enjoyed this part one review of Hennessy Hammock's Ultralight Backpacker.